So, you want to learn on how to get high FPS and low delay without spending a penny? Well, in today's video, I'm going to be fully optimizing your PC in just under 5 minutes. Alright, so the first thing we're going to be optimizing is general game settings. The first thing you want to do is you want to click on the Windows icon and then search View, Advanced, System Settings, and then click on this right here. It's going to bring you here, and you want to click on the Settings in the Performance tab. This should pop up after you click it and you just want to click custom and you want to make sure to show thumbnails instead of icon. Show window contents while dragging. Smooth edges of screen fonts are all on. Then you just want to click apply and OK. And do the same for this tab. And search setting. Once you have it open, you just want to search up game mode setting and then click enter. It should bring you onto this page and you just want to click game mode settings, which is right here. You want to make sure game mode is on and then you want to click graphics. If you use Windows full screen, you want to make sure optimizations for Windows games is turned on. You then want to click on this drop down for advanced graphics settings and make sure this is on. This is also perfectly fine if you don't have the setting. But then you want to scroll down and you want to click add desktop app. You want to first go to local disk program files then you want to click on any of these files click e and it should bring you to epic games you then want to double click on that double click on fortnite fortnite game binaries win64 and then you should be in this folder which has the files you want to make sure the biggest file fortnite client win64 shipping.exe is selected and then you just want to click add it should pop up right here you just want to click on this drop down you want to make sure gpu preference is on your gpu if you have one and not let windows decide or power saving okay and if you have windowed full screen make sure this is also on then you want to go into apps installed app and go through this list and delete anything you don't need after you're done with that you want to go to personalization and then you want to scroll down and you're going to see device usage you want to make sure all of these are off and when you turn them on just exit out all right next what you want to do is you want to join my discord link in the description after you join you're going to see my channel you just want to scroll down and you're going to see free tweaks right under it is video resources and you just want to click it then you want to search this video will fully tweak your PC and then click enter. This should be the first result and you just want to click it. You're going to see all the video resources here and then you're just going to see this Google Drive link. You just want to click it. At, once you're here, you're going to see full tweak optimizations that zip and then you're going to see this download button. You want to click it. After you download it, you should see it right here. You want to right click and extract this. With WinRAR. It should bring you here and you just want to double click on this file, double click again, and you're going to see these five things. The first thing is going to be NVIDIA Profile Spectre. If you have an AMD GPU, skip to this timestamp. But first, what you want to do is you want to double click and then you want to double click on, on this file. It should ask you to run as an administrator, just click yes. And it should pop up right here. You want to go to the search and you want to search Fortnite and then click enter. Then you want to drag the free settings and it should automatically do the tweaks. You're then going to see this apply changes button and you just want to click it. Then exit out. You then want to go back to the full tweaks optimization folder and then two, which is Fortnite game user settings. What you want to do is you want to Windows R or you want to search run and then you want to type percent local app data percent and then click enter click on any of these files click f until you see fortnite game then you want to double click it saved config windows client and then you're going to see game user setting after that you just want to swap these out after you do that you can just close out of this then you're going to see mouse and keyboard tweaks and you just want to double click on this file so right click on this and run this as administrator and it's going to automatically start disabling a few tweaks next what you want to do is you want to determine if your cpu is high end mid end or low end if you don't know what your cpu is considered just type it below in the comments and then after you do that just close the program four is auto runs you just want to double click on the file and then run this as administrator too it's going to open up this program and then you're going to click log on and you want to make sure anything you don't need is off like for example i do not need adobe creative cloud on when i turn on my computer and anything you don't know just leave it on after you do that you, you can just exit out next what you want to do is you want to go to clean useless files and then you're going to see disk cleanup where you want to double click it should open up the program and automatically start deep loading your pc and that is going to pop up with this page I recommend selecting recycle bin, temporary files, temporary internet files, and make sure that direct direct x shader cache is off because if you delete this, Fortnite will have to re-download them which will give you less FPS. You then want to click OK and delete files. And once it's done, it should automatically close and then you can right click on the start menu, go to shut down or sign out and restart.